editing a digital writing critique in Microsoft Word is pretty much like editing any, anything else in Microsoft Word. All of the functions that are available to you in Word when you're um, editing a regular Word document are available here as well. Um, so, uh, for example, let's say I want to insert a comment here after the student's first verb, and I want to tell the student that she didn't get to that first verb within the first seven words. Um, I could uh, maybe start with a little bold-faced text here, type a couple of, um, of brackets, and then type my comment right in here. Um, okay, I usually type better than that. Um, all right, so uh, that's fine, but let's say that I want to um, link to the information that I have over here in the media writing tips file about what a first verb is, first verb of a lead is, and and um, and some information about how to get there quickly. Uh, so what I can do is highlight the text that I want to turn into a link. Um, let's uh, choose first verb there, and then I can choose insert and um, uh, link right here and hyperlink. Uh, the, sh the keyboard shortcut for this, by the way, is Control K. Uh, that's actually what I typically use. And then I need to go find my tips.htm file. It's in the same directory as the critique that I'm working on, so it's right here. And finally, choose uh, Bookmark. And up comes a list of pre programmed bookmarks that are in that tips file. I just need to choose one of these to link to. And uh, having had some experience with this file, I know that the um, um, the first verb of a lead link is right here. Uh, they're in alphabetical order, by the way. Um, first verb of a lead, I can uh, highlight it and click OK, or I can just double click on it, either one, and then click OK. And there's the link that I was trying to create. If I want to test it out, you don't have to do this every time, but if I want to, you can hold down the control key on the keyboard and click it. And uh, sure enough, over there, um, the, the first verb of a lead entry for the media writing tips file pops up. So that's how you insert links. It's actually not that difficult. Um, and um, let's see, let's, uh, let's do one more thing. Let's suppose down here at the end, I want to go ahead and include a link to my example file. I've already created my example file. I cover how to do that in a different video. Um, but now I want to link to it and, um, and uh, fix things so that when the student clicks on that link, the, the example will pop up over here in the left pane. Uh, so again, I insert a, um, well, I, actually I need to type this first. Um, I'm going to do control B to slip into boldface mode, two brackets, and then type, um, be sure to check out, check out my example. I'm going to make uh, my example um, the, the, the text that I'm going to turn into a link. Uh, control K on the keyboard, that's the, again the shortcut. You could use insert and link up here with your mouse if you wanted to. Um, but instead of finding the tips file right here, I'm going to find my uh, 5 2 a key file. This is the uh, my example file. Um, and click OK. I've highlighted it, and I'm going to click OK, or I could double-click on it. Um, and now, when I check this link out, um, my example file pops up um, over here. Um, so um, I'll just continue doing this until I have edited all of the... Uh, uh, remaining assignments down here. Um, so that's how, th that, those are the fundamentals of, uh, of editing work in the context of a digital writing critique.